but watch how you're showing up and your tone. It's absolutely critical. So aside from me just proving it to you, this is gonna get a little tricky because the room is a little bit tight. So feel free to push these tables up a little bit here. I want everybody to stand up and we're gonna do this exercise together because showing up matters and I can show you my version of it and you'll learn from me, but you doing it, you'll really learn it. So. Showing up matters, right? You obviously have to show up to the appointment to get the deal. But if you show up to the appointment and you're not in a good mood, chances are you're not gonna get the deal and chances are you may actually mess up your brand or reputation. Would you agree? Yes. Okay, so because how you show up really matters, we're gonna do two rounds of this. You're gonna have to move around a bit, so just prepare. What I want round one to be is you're gonna go around and you're gonna say hi to as many people as you can. What I want you to do though is, I wanna make sure that nobody laughs or smiles and that your intention is to make sure the other person feels crappy. <laughs> so, some of you don't know how to do this because some of you are professional, like make everyone happy. But do not smile, do not jack it up. Here's what this looks like, okay? You're, when I say go, you have 30 seconds. As many people as you can get to, you're just gonna be like this. Whatever. Oh, God. Okay, I want you to make them feel bad. Don't punch anyone, please. No one get hurt. All right, ready? 30 seconds, go. Make them feel bad. Make them feel unimportant. Keep going, five seconds. Get to one more person. Stop. Oh, this is gonna get crazy. Stop, stay where you are. Stay where you are. I see you already trying to get back to home base. Stay where you are, okay. It's okay, you're bumping up to a few people. You're gonna become friends. Okay, second round, second round. Get ready. Second round, not only are you gonna make the per other person extremely happy, you're going to absolutely blow their minds with your energy. You're gonna pretend that this is your long lost family member, mom, dad, you have not seen after 20 years and you gotta show them the love. I don't wanna see like, hey, nice to see you. No, 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 that's not how we do it. 30 seconds, go. <laughs> One more hug and sit down. It's always harder to get you guys to settle down after this. All right, grab your seat, grab your seat. Guys, this is the best I have seen so far in two months. <laughs> Clap it up, good job. All right, real quick. What did you notice between round one, round two? How was round one? <laughs> Sucks, quiet. More energy. You met more people. Yeah, that's a good observation. You meet more people. Right. How, do, do you guys remember more about round one or more about round two? You could say one. That's okay. I'm not trying to set you up for round two. More round two? Okay. What felt good about round two? Yeah. Bill made you feel great. Right. Who, do I have any like introverts in the room? Were you guys like, oh my God, don't touch me. 
<laughs> I always, I always find a few people that are like, ah, oh, yes, hi. No, you guys did great. Yes, the energy was way different, right? How many of you know that person, whether they're in your office or in your family, that when they walk into the room, you're like, oh God, it's gonna be a long Thanksgiving, right? You're like, ah, oh, I gotta see this family member twice a year, Thanksgiving and Christmas, we can get through it. No, but you also know some people when they walk into the room, you're like, ah, oh, okay, good. This is like, I need some of that love and energy, right? You can be that. I'm not saying you need to go around and hug everybody, but check your energy. The fastest way you can start to shift your brand is your tone and your body language because that's 93% of how you communicate so just think about that for a second you you can share that whenever you meet people and they'll instantly start to feel that you consistently do that now you're starting to get branded as somebody that I just I don't know why but I like to be around them 